down here so I can get that as well as my mug in the photo. But anyway, I stumbled across some more industrial supplies, supplied fatwood today. This is a plank, a pine plank off a pine pallet. One of the guys broke it with a forklift and I happened to look over. This is what I've seen. It's getting a little bit dark. I hope you guys can see this. But it's fat wood running down here. Resin all over the back. And you can see that it runs the whole the whole way down. So I thought I've got to bring that home, throw that up on the video, and um, there you go. Not only can you buy it as non-structural pine, but you can also get it by accident at work. Okay. Also, also um, my little Smith's um, Pack Pal Tinder maker arrived. I've already given it a run. I just made a video, but my head was chopped out of it and the dogs were going off so I thought I'd try my luck at making a second video anyway the dogs obviously must love it when I hit record anyway for the people most of you I know know how this works for the other people who don't don't know what it is basically it's a cheese grater for wood and you make tinder to start a fire that will catch a spark and it will start a fire so Anyway, I'll just quickly sh give you a quick little rundown. Most of, most of the guys that I know sort of online anyway, they know how this works. Not gonna go too crazy, I'll just get enough for a fire. By the way, this is a piece of this pallet, so we're testing it out. I know it works because I've already tried it, but it definitely works. So I'll show one of the guys at work who didn't know anything about fat wood, and yeah, we just lit it up while we were at work, and there's an, a new guy who knows. Spreading the love. Basically that's it there, just flammable fluff. Just thought that I'd throw a little bit of extra on there because I'll do an early happy Fatwood Friday for all you guys who you can get into that because tomorrow I don't know if I'm going to be able to upload I'm going I'm going camping this weekend at a mate's property I will be filming but I will probably be out of reception so I won't be able to upload um, but I am working on another video that's um, at an old World War II military base. It was an American base called Camp Cable. It was the biggest military base in the Southern Hemisphere during World War II. Um, it's about an hour from my house and it was named after, I believe, the first US sailor or soldier who was killed off the Australian coast by a Japanese submarine being torpedoed so they named the the camp after him and 
Um, as soon as I found out that it was a military base, I didn't know until about 10 years ago. But as teenagers, we used to ride our motorbikes, go four-wheel driving up there. And as soon as I found out, went and got myself a metal detector, went up there, found heaps of really cool stuff. Um, yeah. Um, what else? After the war, it was used as a pine plantation, so we're going to get fat wood there. So I'm thinking I can throw a few videos together, a little bit of storyline to it, um, what I know about it anyway. I've got aerial photographs from during the war, I've got a map of the place, I've got some relics that I dug up, and some other um, bits and pieces, and you know. So, uh, anyway. I probably, if I can post something before I leave for the um, camping trip this weekend, I will. But we'll, we'll just see how it pans out. Anyway guys, just a little quick one. Happy Fatwood Friday. See you later.